Welcome back to 504 Road Trips. Today we continue our trip west on US Highway 72, beginning at mile marker 88 as we enter the city of Madison, Alabama. Madison, situated primarily within Madison County, but also extending into adjacent Limestone County, constitutes a part of the Huntsville metropolitan area, the second largest such area in the state. Huntsville surrounds Madison from nearly all sides, with some smaller unincorporated regions within and around Madison spanning both Madison and Limestone counties. This geographical arrangement will become apparent as we journey through the Huntsville city limits once more before departing the vicinity. A large part of Madison was the Clift Farm, dating back to 1850, which has now been developed into a suburban neighborhood. You'll notice cross streets with the name Jack Clift Boulevard, Aunt Maud Drive, John Thomas Drive, and Uncle Frank Boulevard, among others, named for various members of the Clift family. Having been officially incorporated in 1869, the town of Madison experienced significant changes during and after World War II when military and NASA activities shifted to Huntsville. This shift led to a population surge in the region. Improved highways that received government support facilitated suburban expansion, drawing residents to newly developed areas on the outskirts where fresh residences were constructed. As of 1980, Madison's population reached 4,057. During the latter part of the 20th century, Madison's population witnessed rapid growth as it transformed into a suburb of Huntsville. A pivotal moment occurred in 1986 when Madison residents overwhelmingly choose to maintain their independent status rather than merge with Huntsville. By the year 2010, the population had escalated to 42,938, and over the ensuing decade, it continued to swell, reaching a total of 56,933 residents. We're back inside the Huntsville city limits now, and will remain so until we cross the county line into Limestone County. At County Line Road, we cross into Limestone County, which had a population of 103,570 as of the 2020 census. The county's largest city and county seat is Athens, which we'll see later on. Athens is the only incorporated city that lies entirely within the borders of Limestone County, but small portions of Huntsville and Madison spill over from Madison County, and Decatur lies mostly in Morgan County, but has a small portion in Limestone County.
We enter the city of Athens, the county seat of Limestone County, with a population of 25,406 as of the 2020 census. Established in 1818, Athens stands as one of the earliest officially recognized cities in the state. Its incorporation took place a year prior to Alabama's admission into the Union in 1819. Notably, both William Wyatt Bibb, Alabama's first governor, and his brother Thomas Bibb, the second governor, called Athens their home. Originally recognized as a hub for cotton production and a railroad center, Athens saw a transformation during the aerospace expansion of the 1950s and 60s. This shift brought it closer to the sphere of influence of the nearby industrial hub Huntsville, particularly due to the gradual decline in local cotton farming. Of significance within Athens is the Browns Ferry Nuclear Power Plant, which was initiated in 1974 under the Tennessee Valley Authority. Initially, it held the distinction of being the world's largest nuclear facility and has been a substantial source of employment for the region. This plant significantly contributes to the electricity supply for the broader Huntsville-Decatur metro area. However, a pivotal event transpired on March 22, 1975 when the Browns Ferry plant experienced a severe incident, marking one of the most notable nuclear accidents in the history of the United States apart from the Three Mile Island incident. This occurrence stemmed from a worker using a candle to detect air leaks, inadvertently causing a fire among control wires. This incident posed a temporary threat to the operational control of the reactor. We conclude today's video midway through the city of Athens at mile marker 78. Thanks for watching. We've enabled channel memberships, so for just one dollar or more a month, you too can help support our channel. Click the link in the description to join. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up, post a comment, subscribe, share and follow us on social media, and join us for our next 504 road trip.